Well, hello guys. I found myself here at Disney's Contemporary Resort today. We're gonna go visit Steakhouse 71 for lunch today for another awesome adventure of Rachel's Ratatouille review. So what kind of scrumptiousness will we get? Only time will tell. So I'll hit you back as soon as I get there. I really do love this resort. It's so cool how the monorail just goes into it like that. Super fun. And just like that, it's headed on in and just like we are too. So see you when I get there. Well, we found our way to Steakhouse 71. Let's head on in and get something scrumptious because that's what you do when you go to Steakhouse 71. All kinds of scrumptious goodies on here for appetizers, for sure. And all the things you can get for lunch, each one of them actually looks really, really good too. And even more down here as well. Not sure what I'm gonna get yet, but only time will tell. Then here's all the scrumptiousness they have for dessert too. I mean, you can't go wrong. Some cocktails as well, regular beverages, but it's all about the dessert menu. Maybe we'll get one of those too. Totally wanted some French onion soup. Smells super good, it looks super good. I can't wait to dig into this soupy, bready, French onion goodness, oh yeah. All right, this French onion soup is super good. It's got so much bread in there. It's got so much of this melty cheese. Like it's seriously deliciously awesome. So flavorful too. We taste a little bit of the wine, some of the beef broth, and it's just super good. So I totally got their stack burger here. Got some extra pickles because I love pickles. And this burger is seriously, it's so tall. It looks so good and juicy. I can't wait to dive into that. And then for my side, I decided to get the Caesar salad that it came with because that just sounded so much better than fries right now. And this honestly looks really good. I know it's gonna taste super good as well. So let's dig on into this burger and this awesome Caesar salad goodness. Raspberry goodness on top of this huge piece of chocolate cake. Look how big this thing is. This thing's seriously crazy. Got some gold leaf on the end of it, and this looks so chocolatey and so good in so many chocolate cake type ways. All right, so that was super good in so many ways. French onion soup, super scrumptious, so much flavor, like the cheese, super gooey, super oniony, a little bit of zest from the bread that was in there, so good. And then the awesome burger that I had, literally stacked and double, it's like so good. Super cheesy, the meat had a ton of flavor to it. And uh, the pork belly in there was little hidden gems of like just pure goodness in each one of it with like that super good like soft bun and then the aioli on it, super yummy. But don't forget those pickles that are in there too. Seriously, those are super good. And like they just had a little bit of zest. They're more on like the bread and butter side. So it's always a little treat when you get to have those inside those because usually everyone just puts dill. So like, I don't know, pickle connoisseur. If you guys watch this channel enough, you know how much I love those. So much so and so good. And like that side Caesar, it's just really fresh and just enjoyable and yummy in so many awesome ways. Well, I mean, you can't go wrong with that. Then that chocolate cake, so rich and delicious. Tasted really good, it had like a zest of like the raspberry in it too, making it just that much more enjoyable from start to finish. Well, thank you guys for watching this episode of Rachel's Ratatouille Review. Please be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe here on YouTube because you never know what other random Disney restaurants or Six Flags restaurants for the Foodies of Six Flags series I might film for you. Love you all. Stay safe, beautiful, amazing. Like, comment, share. Peace.